So when we look at the four zones, we could actually look at the four zones face down. Now, when I look at our pelvis, I want to look at to see the leg length discrepancy between left and right side. So I want you to zoom in for me. Come over here. Come in a little bit closer. When I look down at the feet, can you see how my left thumb is a little bit higher than my right thumb? I don't know if you can see that. So what that's telling me is that this pelvis is a little bit shorter. So this hip is actually rolled this way. It's rolled backwards. So what I want to do is I want to wedge that area. Lift this leg up for me. So that's going to cause that pelvis to roll this way. And then this is going to cause the pelvis to go the opposite direction. Now we're ready for some manual therapy. Now, we do specialized manual therapy techniques to help break up scar tissue and help relax the nervous system. So one of the first techniques we're going to do is just rubbing. So this is going to warm the tissues up. It probably feels really nice, right? And as I'm warming up the tissues, I'm just going to work my way up and down the spine so the body has the opportunity to relax. And as I'm doing this, the pelvis is resetting at the same time. Now, let's have you come around this way. And this is a manual therapy technique that typically feels really good. Sometimes we use our hands. Sometimes we use technology, like a hypervolt or a technology called a vibrocussor. Kelly, how's this feel? Good. And we can work our way all the way down. And this is what's known as warming technique. After the warming technique, we actually start going into other techniques to help break up any scar tissue. And I'm just working my way down the spine. And I'm going to find some tight tender points into the lower back. And we're just going to pump the muscle. This is a technique called pompage. It's a French technique that helps to relax the muscles. Is that too much pressure? Does that feel okay? Good. And then I'm going to work my way down to the hip. And ideally, we'd spend a lot more time doing this, but only for demonstration purposes. We're just going to go pretty quickly through it. But the whole protocol only takes about five minutes to do, and the clinical outcomes are very, very high with it. And then all our exercises are based on those four zones. We want to create symmetry between left and right side and make sure those four zones are working properly. You okay?